Paul, what a, what a day for the club. A bit nervous at the end there, but a brilliant victory. Yeah, it was. It was a bit nervy at the end. Um, I think um, I've heard the phrase of a bottom like a rabbit's nose came to mind. Um, it was a bit twitchy. Um, but the first half performance, which was which was up there with, you know, with it. I think you'll go a long way to find a better first half performance. A thoroughly deserved lead, um, and a thoroughly deserved win. You know, as I say, we were holding on a little bit um, towards the end, which you go going to. Conditions just seemed to pick up massively. I know it was windy first half, but just gust second half. Um, we couldn't get out at times, but I thought we stuck to our shape and plan. Brilliant. They've scored a couple of goals. Um, penalty is a penalty, which gives them a little bit something to go at. But like you say, to a man, we were excellent and, and thoroughly deserved. Yeah, three goals, three headers as well, which is quite unusual. There's some brilliant goals as well. Yeah, they were, and there's things we work on. So um, pleased that you know they seem to come off in the game. And Paddy getting Paddy and Connor. Um, Paddy getting a, a, another header or a header, Connor getting his first. Um, Ahmed just like scoring in this in this cup in this trophy, um, you know. But I thought we I thought we were really good. The subs who came on as well, Pez, Rafi, um, Mo, you know, just 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 coming on and just doing ev everything you want them to do as as subs. I said before the game, you know, it was going to be about the subs as well, and not just coming on with a hope of doing something you know watch the game study the game look at how you're going to go on or you might go on and make an impact don't just do it by chance do it by plan and, and to be fair they did that yeah. great for Connor to get his first goal for the club he's been after it for a while he's come close a few times but it was a lovely moment for him. yeah it was and I, I, to be honest this morning I I was I, I was undecided with the team I knew the shape but I was undecided with the team and I just fancied him to get his goal, um, you know, because I knew he, they wouldn't like the type of forward he is. You know, he's, he's raw, he's he's aggressive with his run, and he puts himself about. And um, I'm delighted that he has got off the mark in, in such a such a big game for us. Yeah, and to have to hold on into us, you know, seemingly in this added time to get the red card. I'm lucky with Byron; we didn't quite see what happened there, but harsh. that was real. That was real hard. It's a harsh red. It's a harsh red. He's stepped across the lads, he's not thrown an elbow, but their staff were outside the ref's room um, at half time. And when you just get a feeling that the ref's going to maybe sway a little bit, every, that, every nudge went their way, every, every nudge that against or, or what should have been for us, he never gave. Um, and you just felt, oh, it's not going to be one of them. He's not going to help them along the way because because of the standard and he's used to refereeing that. But, you know, to hold on in, in those circumstances with with 10 men and uh, and the spirit that the lads have shown was was different class. And I'm delighted for everyone at the club. It's, you know, the prize money really helps. I know it's not bundles compared to the FA Cup, but, you know, each each round you go through, the prize money obviously increases, and it and it's massive for us. Um, you know, but um, just delighted for everyone here, and and hopefully get another good draw and uh, see where it takes us.